Welcome to the club. I am the VIP, and once again, we got another loud flipping title screen that I can't even do. So let's just immediately go into the first one. And am I even recording this? I really hope I am. Oh okay, my am. god! So. RPG horror? Okay, so this is us. Like, uh, 11 or 12, maybe even 13, maybe. And this. Why is that thing got like a villager face? So, bed, go to sleep. We want to hear the explanation. Oh, right. If you guys are wondering what this is, I've played this game before in like a free random game, and I turn on sticky keys. I've played this in like a free random games. There we go. Where are the shadows? Stand the path. The eyelash down the path. Hold on. Oh shoot, whoops. Here we go. I remember what you did. They remember too. You were the reason that we were all there. <laughs> it happened because of you. You can't tell anyone. Why would you? It is your fault. Oh, shoot. All of it. Okay. I just wanted to show you guys that. That's it. But. Okay. There you go. Loud titles free. Get it out of here. Oh, how are you feeling today? Yeah. It's been two weeks. I understand that it is a very traumatic experience. Okay, it sounds like we're in like therapy. But luckily, your brother wasn't seriously hurt. You have to remember, they weren't real. They were just machines. They aren't capable of harming anyone. What happened? Was it just an accident? What happened was just an accident. He was just... broken. But it's okay now. You're safe here. You remember the... from the theater? Ah yes, the old ones that you and your father went to a year ago, right? Your father has told me about what happened while you were there. We got separated from each other that day when not... when the incident happened. Have you still had nightmares since we last met? Were they about those monsters you drew for me? Oh, ho, ho, ho. oh, <laughs> look at the teeth on the cat. Oh, oh my gosh. gosh, they just got like, it's like creepy. It's got like, it's one of those weird pictures that are creepy because they have like eye sockets and incredibly small pupils, like very small eyes. That just freaks me out a whole bunch and I don't know why. You're a very creative girl. But you can't let your fears take control of your imagination. In order for your nightmares to end, you have to face your fears. You have to face the monsters. Can I not? Can I just like bring us? Can I just get my papa's heater and then go bang, bang, bang? That would probably get rid of my nightmares real fast. That's what I do in my nightmares. I have nightmares. I get a gun and I go ba ba ba. Show them that you're not afraid. That's what I do. <laughs> I'm sorry. You understand? No! Oh, no. It's the only way. Now, Mary. That's the person we play as in the first and second one, I do believe. I need you to try and remember what happened on that day a year ago. There they go. Fading out into the darkness. Here we go. Oh, hey, aren't you even gonna say hello? Hello? It's me! I'm the Origami Cat! Oh gosh, what? How am I here? You're dreaming right now. Sort of. At least. This room you're in is your old room from before you moved. But right now, it looks like you barely remember it. You've had a lot of nightmares lately, right? Well, that's why I am here. I have a couple of tricks to fighting the monsters. Remember a few years ago? You had trouble sleeping almost every night. So your dad gave you a cassette tape player. With a tape of quiet music that he made for you 
you so you can sleep. I bet it would also help you with sleeping better now. The other thing is, the monsters hate light. So I'd suggest flashing light in their eyes whenever you can. Unless they're under your bed. Listen for if they go there. In such a case, peek under the bed to see which side they're at. Then go back up and face the opposite direction. Turning your back will lure them out from under the bed. Listen closely for the sound of them peeking out. And then... Also, by the way, the sound of them peeking out is the cre is you can hear creaking coming from the other side of the room. Face back towards the opposite end of the bed room again. Give them a good dose of light in the eyes. Now, Take that! go look for the tape player. I'll stay here if you need my help. And now we go into the tree, the deep state. And I'll be with you when I get the cassette tape player. And hey, here we go. Everyone recording. Yes, there we go. On arcade game one, that was loud. And on the tape player. And now press Watch the dreamscape. Yes. Wait, the tape player? Yes I do. Super duper! Super duper! Good luck with the nightmares! That sounds like a psycho thing someone would say. Okay, I am extremely nervous for this right now. Because I don't have an actual mouse. I have to use this stupid touchpad on my laptop. Pretty as I'll ever be. Oh boy. And we are in. First night. Ooh, that, that's a nice loading screen. And my mouse has appeared. Oh, great. First of all, first thing. I'm nervous, bro. I am so nervous. Got Jack Sepkai. Mark Plyer. Hey, that spells the name. That spells the creator's name. Oh. Oh. Hello? Oh. Oh my gosh! What the frick? What the frick? Okay. Okay. Be gone, fuck! Are you serious? This dude, I, I was laughing at the cat, and then the guy just appeared. Oh my gosh. Are you serious? This sucker for real just appeared right in front of me. What? I heard that. I heard that. Yep. Multiplier? That's a Skyrim reference. That was a jump scare all in itself, bro. Ooh, I didn't even hear you. That did that one that actually stopped my heart. This dude just appeared out of nowhere. I did not expect him to appear, dude. That was terrifying.
What? Denied. Is that knocking? He's going to attack soon. There was two knockings. Why? Okay, Pop goes. Oh no, that, that's Rachel's. You. Got you. Okay. I played two different knocking sounds. And I'm pretty sure when it's the super loud banging, I'm pretty sure that means that he's coming in. Like, there's no doubt about it. He's coming in. You cheeky. Sucko didn't even knock. You rude sack of- why is my door just slightly open? Like, close that! So, like, the first time... You hear the sound... Of the door opening, I can hear slight... Quiet knocking. So if you hear me panic and you don't hear any knocking... Well, that's your fault. But I can hear the slight knocks. See, if there's slight knocks, that probably means that he's not coming in. He'll wait. This tape, dude, does not last long at all. Don't you dare die on me now. Let's go! Oh my gosh, go on! Got you. But I missed the sound. It wasn't it wasn't making the creaking sound so I thought I was about to die, dude. I was about to be so mad if I died. Woohoo! Oh boy. Perfect timing, Kate. Perfect timing. Hold that. Hold that. Sucker. That's a fun as Freddy's thing. But not four, that's the robot. Jack, save me. Or Mark. Let's go! My music just ended too. Woo! Yo, that first one got me. First attack. Oh my gosh, bro. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, dude, I, I felt like I, what, I felt like I hadn't breathed like that entire time, bro. Hey, what's up? 
I love this theater. My family has come here for months now. You like it too? Well, kind of. I haven't been to a theater in real life, though. I've always wanted to. It's a poster for the Rat and Cat Theater. The Rat. That's who I was just fighting. Week 41. 1961. That's way before FNAF. 1983 is like that first major event I'm pretty sure in the game. So scheduled. Ugh. The Mystical Tree. Tuesday, the Cat's Birthday. Wednesday, the Picnic. Thursday, Vinny loses his toy. Vinny, that's the name of the quote reverse puppet from the first and second game. Well, actually, no, not the second game. I don't think he was in there. But Friday, question mark, a surprise. I ha I've actually always wanted to go to this kind of theater before, but like I haven't been able to. Hey, uh, who? Backstage, employees only. I'm not gonna talk to you real quick. Because I don't like how you're looking at me. These arcade games are so boring. I once asked the rat if we could get some new ones soon, but then he got a bit angry. The rat is a real jerk. Oh. Astro Pinball, I would get the biggest high score on that. And Jungle Pinball, oh yeah. Please don't hog the games. Share with everyone. Whack-a-mole. Uh, of course. Wow, this is this is the arcade, really? I guess it is 1961. So you're looking a little bit different. Right? Boy, sweetie, are you having fun? Well, hold your hat. The place I just picked out. It's just the two of us. While your brother is at camp, you can decide what we should have for dinner tonight. Sushi, sushi and tacos, please. <laughs> oh, hey, what's up? I haven't seen the puppeteer's puppet yet. I've heard that it's as big as a person. Wow. Hello, cupboard. Oh my gosh, dude, that text. Text sounds like a freaking machine gun to the face. Hey, you kid, I'm the rat. Nice to meet you. Sorry, the show's about to start. Sorry, the show's about to start in a few minutes. I'm gonna wait till after his text because it's so loud. Wanna play hide and seek? You are a stranger asking a child to play hide and seek. I'm gonna give you five across what the What kind ass. of a psycho are you? I guess I got nothing else to do. Sure. Nito, you go and hide. Why don't I stay here and talk to a hunter? Thank you. Are you looking for a good hiding spot? Try hiding underneath one of the tables. Huh. Well, there's some grown-ups down here, so please protect me and keep me safe. Yeah, I want to be near like the grown-up. I don't say, oh no, let's go, let's go by my dad actually. That could probably protect me. Maybe. Well, probably not. He'll probably dad, if dad tries to square up with him, he'd be like, oh, we're just playing hard to see. Nothing. Like, okay, sure, that's fine. Let's hide under this table. Dad, please don't let the bad man get me. Please don't let the bad man get me, Dad. You son of a bitch! You sack of crap! Ha ha ha! I found you. Really? Really? Oh, you son of a! <sighs> anyway, guys, I hope you guys did enjoy this video of Five Nights at Candy's 3. I sure did. Like, that jump scare, it got me good. Nice job, Emil. Or, I'm pretty sure that's how you call him. Or, a mile. I don't know, I'm just gonna call him Emil. I hope you don't, I hope you don't get mad at me. Anyway.
<laughs> hope you guys did enjoy this video. Please leave a like and comment down below. And hit the subscribe button and the little bell notification so you know when the clothes will be open. I will see you guys in the next video. I need to go take a shower and change my everything. Because I am sweating and that's pretty much all you need to know.